Anyhow, let's get to this. Let's get to this, my youth. And big salute to JF. Larry. 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 Let's hear this shit. Let's hear this shit. Ready? Want to hear it? Here we go. <laughs> this guy's a spaz. Fuck. <laughs> This nigga's so rich. Yeah, pull up on the make it put it out. Bitch, you know that when I see you, we gon' make it put it out. I got the ficky, ficky, ficky shot. That's what he's doing to man's? Watch out for Texas for 6 9 He's gonna fuck you up. He's gonna rob you for your chain. Oh, Lee. Really, eh? He used that chicken spot line already. They posted up at the chicken spot. I, I swear when he first, first came back, he was like, I'm at a chicken spot. What's your obsession with the chicken spot, bro? And like, what's your obsession with recycling lines, fam? I'm, why am I lyrically breaking this guy down like as if he's a good rapper? Just finish your thing, bro. How the fuck he's supposed to keep it on him? You're a felon who's still under witness protection. Who's a rat? Talking about I keep it on me. Yeah, I guess you're allowed. You're you you work with a the boy then. Here's a fucking police official licensed firearm. Here, hold that. Protect yourself, you snitch. What's happening here? What am I missing? Where does this guy get friends from? Who are all these niggas? And then nobody's wearing one color anymore. <laughs> Y'all never noticed that? All his new crew, they're just all the interchangeable gang. We're just all part of different gangs. We're the color, we're the United Gangs of Benetton. Like, I swear, like, there's like, I know Bloods and Crips aren't always wearing red or blue anymore. It's a new time. But when it's music video time, you, you know, there's like a clear distinction. These are the Bloods. Those are the Crips. These guys... They're not Latin kings because they're black. Right? They're just the, the, the nondescript. We could be any gang. We're the paid for gang. As long as you pay us a collection of a collecting, a collection of us actors will get together. Let us know what you want us to say. Okay, we'll practice it at home. You want us to do some hand gestures? We got you. Okay? And just send us half up front, and then when we get to the video shoot, we'll collect the other half. Thanks. Good trip in the rolling too slowly. Look, big watch, big Cuban, top win. Why is he kissing the man? Did I just see that? 
<laughs> what? 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 Bro. Bro. <laughs> Shaq and Cheese wants to know if they're paid actors or a gang. They're the paid actor gang. Look at, okay, look at everybody here. Every, nobody's the same. There's the proof. Nobody's the same. There's him who's about to get kissed or he just has to listen to 6 ix breath rap right next to his head because he's not trying to kiss him. He's just rapping really close to him and it's like, bro, I didn't get paid that much to be here today. Like, you're yelling in my ear, fam, and we had to do this take like five times. Like, stop. You're loud and my ear hurts. And on take three, you actually kissed me a couple times, bro. Like, I don't like that. You're going to have to pay me extra for this shoot. And then there's this guy back here. He's either a Spanish guy or he's like a regular white dude that comes from like, I don't know, not Richmond Hill because they're in New York. So, I don't know, fucking... Long Island. Okay. But you can't see his face. He has a mask on. And then there's this, this guy right here, kind of Cuban looking Spanish guy. There's a mix of different gang members. It's not like a unified, oh, we're the black gang. We're the white gang. We're the, no, it's the fucking United Gangs of Benetton over here. Everybody gets to be in the gang. You don't even have to get jumped in. What's your fit like? Where do you shop? You're in. Is that Supreme? You're in the gang. The fuck? This guy's like really up on this guy's face, bro. Like, come the fuck on. What gang sign is this? Put my one, one block. You don't know about one block? You guys aren't gangster. You're really not. Look, big watch, big Cuban, top wear, send Addy. My guys, come near, no smiles, no games, fun wear. Got a day, can get away, fun wear. Mickey. <laughs> These niggas right here? Come on. Stop playing with me, yo. Look at this. This guy here. He might be gang gang. He's a little bit of a big guy. But he's probably security. This nigga here. High school. Or he's a college student. My bad. University student. Here's the white guy again. Right? From Long Island. Or no, here's the white guy from Long Island. Sorry, my bad. Okay, pay attention. Here's another maybe grimy grimy. And then there's this guy here who's holding his shoulders. Look at this. Hold on, I got the chat in the way, my bad. Look at this. What? What's going on here? You're breaking the touch barrier, my G. Right here. All up in there. Huh? Come on, fam. They have some baddies in here and listen I'm going to say something I'm going to say a bold statement the song's not whack if he wasn't a rat and a piece of shit I would actually like say you know what people should listen to this this is good shit it's good shit the beat is hard the hook, but his reputation is trash. You're right. 
know what I'm saying? So now, like, even if you do some good shit, you don't even have to be talented. Like, you have the money and the resources for people to mail you in all of the things you need. Here is your hook. Here is your beat. If you need a verse, here is a verse too. You have all the formula to make a hit. Thank you. But. Hmm. There is that ratten thing there. Just that one thing. Just that one thing. You know, that whole case in front of the federal government and we the people see Daniel Fernandez, like that whole thing and, you know, blood set and, you know, 50 years, 100 years for you, 75 years for you. You know, that was on you. So when you're talking about, you know, you know, I see you at the chicken spot. I'm going to rob you for your chain. I'm going to beat you up. I'm going to give you a wedgie. My guys in the back, they're not trying to have that shit. Even though they're all like paid actors. Them niggas, the way that they act when they do that ice grill. Best ice grill in the game. Oscar performance. You think when niggas see 6 9 on the street, they're tucking their chain? Holy fuck. I see all five feet of him walking towards me. He might take my chain. He's with four guys. No. They're like, hmm. I wonder if he thinks I'm going to shoot him. You know what I'm saying? Because he can't just be walking around like, <laughs> everything's okay, everything's fine. Like, no, niggas, they're going to outpo you eventually, fam. So when you see him, you're not like, oh, shit, cover my watch, 6 9 No, you're like looking at him like, is that him? Is that him? Yo, that's 6 9 Hey. <laughs> hey, did you see 6 9 I see him walking. Yo, you're not scared. Are we? He's trying to tell us we need to be afraid. Like, if you're a, if you're a lick, you're getting you're getting it. You know what I'm saying? Chain pop off. Oh shit! Six nine snuffing you in the face. Gangs behind him like yeah, nigga. What? That's that. This is what he's. This is the image that he's trying to perpetrate to you guys. Okay. You're supposed to believe this. But there you are, just New York. No, Toronto. 80% of you niggas is snitches. There's only a few solid niggas out there for real, for real. All that 50-50, 50% of you niggas would be solid or, you know, um, 60, 70% of you niggas would be solid and the other 30 you got to watch out for. That shit died in 2010. I'll tell you why. Social media and the laws implemented as far as for Toronto. Okay, because I could, you know, we the Toronto network, right? Mike Harris. I repeat, social media and Mike Harris. The premier who implemented double bunking, took away two for one, um, took away APR. Made it way easier to get up in the motherfucking jail cells and get convicted. Combined with this shit right here, where half of the shit you guys say you don't really fucking mean. Guess what we got? 80% of you niggas that when you get caught doing a crime, you're telling. Trust me, I got paperwork. Not on one person. 
Y'all niggas are tellers. You're tattletales. Not just 6 9 Enough for owner are tattletales. Okay? So all the people who jump up on 6 9s back, you have a friend who ratted. And you still hang with him. Or you ain't done nothing to him. You don't hang with him anymore, but when you see him, he didn't get no snitches. Stitches, I mean. He's fine. He's just over there. You know, you, man, don't talk to him anymore. He's a rat. But no snitches is getting stitches anymore. That shit don't happen no more. It's not the fucking 80s or 90s or the fucking mob movies. Oh, he's the mob niggas ain't even killing their snitches. Their bosses be the snitch. Sammy Gravano is fine. I think it's so stupid. I'm not saying go out there and go snitch on your friends. It's still wrong. Okay? But what I am saying is the shit that y'all might believe that enough people be perpetrating is a lie. You're no better than 6 9 You're just not as famous as he is. Anywho... We're cooking, man. We're cooking with grease. 